Hey y'all. Um, I know a lot of y'all have been asking questions about the horses. Uh, so I figured I'd take a few minutes and tell y'all a little bit about them. Um, Ripley, go on buddy. Uh, the first one here, big brown mare is Shiloh. Come on, Ripley. Get. Yeah. Oh. Ripley. Come on. Come on. Turn. Turn. Hey, come on. Uh, anyway. Uh, Shiloh here is the oldest one on the farm. Uh, other than me. <laughs> uh, she started out life as a racehorse in Pennsylvania. Um, but when she was two years old, she was diagnosed with moon blindness. Uh, simplified, moon blindness is like cataracts in humans. Um, except in horses, it can be extremely painful. Uh, the other difference being that there's no cure. Uh, at some point, Shiloh will wind up being completely blind. Um, you know, and for a, for a horse, um, who's a fight or flight animal, uh, you know, being blind is terrifying. Um, you know, she's got a couple of good things going for her. Um, she knows these fields. Uh, she knows where the fences are. She knows where the water is. Um, you know, things like that. That'll, that'll allow her to get around easier. Uh, you know, it'll give her a little peace of mind, uh, knowing that she's familiar with her surroundings. Um, and the fact that she's not going anywhere. Um, you know, a lot of times people can't handle dealing with a blind horse. Um, so they wind up giving them up or, you know, putting them down or something. Um, you know, we're not going to do that by any, by any means. Um, you know, it's going to be tough on her. Uh, it's going to be tough on all of us. Uh, but we'll do it. We'll get through it. And we're all going to do it together, aren't we? Uh, Shiloh is queen of the pasture. Uh, everybody <laughs> is below her in the food chain, so to speak. Um, she's top dog. She knows it. Aren't you? Uh, she is probably... She's in her late 20s, early 30s maybe. Not sure exactly. But we'll take care of her. Won't we? Yeah.